hello beautiful people you are welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here you are welcome please don't forget to subscribe like this video share with your friend and turn on notification bell to get notified whenever i drop another video so in today's video i'll be teaching you how to cut and make your fonta net and how to get a perfect airline for your fonta and here are the material you need for the tutorial you need a sea sauce you need the pro you need metallic pen or eye pencil you can use either of the two you need needle and thread and you need swiss nets for fanta place your nets on the table or on the floor and measure 13 and a half inches and use the eye pencil to indicate where it stops i usually use metallic pen but i realized that the metallic pen is not showing in the video so that's why i decided to use eye pencil so when you are done with that, you measure six and a half, which is half of 13 inches and indicate where it so you can decide to leave it without sewing it and ventilate it like that but i'm going to show you how to sew it in case you want to so you measure half inch round the net just like you are seeing in this video when you are done with the measurements you trace it out just like we did in the beginning of this video so this is how it looks like when i'm done tracing it out so next thing to do is to fold the net into two equal parts and use scissors to cut that part that I'm cutting in this video. I don't know how to explain that but just cut it closer to the front. So it is from that part you just cut that you are going to start the folding. Just follow what I'm doing in this video. So I'm trying to zoom in so that you can see how i'm folding it so i will leave you to watch how i'm sewing it then i will fast forward some parts before we move to
so this is how it looks like when i'm done sewing it so next thing is to measure how to get the perfect hairline measure four inches from the back to the front and use your pencil to indicate where it stops after that you fold your net into two equal parts then place it on the table from that four inches you just measure place your tape on the net and measure two inch then use pencil to indicate where it stops when you are done measuring that two inches you, from that two inches again you measure another two inches so the remaining one is not up to two inches so you are going to leave it like that then turn your net to the other side and use your pencil to mark that part out too. So you join the line. When you are closer to the first two inches, you go down a little bit and you will do the same for the second two inches. Go down a little bit. Mm -hmm. exactly i don't know if you understand what i just explained now but just follow what i did in this video so you are going And this is how it looks like when I'm done joining it. So I'm going to show you the one I use metallic paint to draw. You can only see the line when I move closer to the camera. So, and when I place it on the table, you cannot see it clearly. So that, that's what I'm trying to show you here. You can see the line, but when it's far to the camera, you will not see the line. So you can see the difference. So if you enjoyed this video, please give this video a thumbs up to help this channel out drop a comment if you have any question share with your friend and turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever i drop another video i will drop a video on how to ventilate a person by four fonta see you in my next video bye